Welcome to the Vine Vodcast. We're in the Metro FM studios with Azania. I was told to pronounce your name Azania because Azania is what I would say. Oh, okay. So, but now I've got it right. So. Azania. Okay, That's good. it. Thank you. How are you today? <laughs> I'm super, I'm super. I'm having right. such an awesome week. Okay, well, we are um, currently in the studio with you. You're off, off air for the Turtle Bliss for yeah. now. Yeah, yeah. But um, the Turtle Bliss is now running. It's on right now as we speak. Um, it's the power play at the moment where we play songs, five songs back to back and it's listener requests. Okay. So that's why we can do this okay. because our listeners have taken over our playlist <laughs> and it's songs that they want to hear every okay. single day at this time on the show. It's really cool that you're engaging with your listeners on that level, you know, like it, it's important to, as a DJ, I Very. think, listen to your listeners. Yes. Yeah. You know. No, I think in our business, what we always have to strive to do is be relevant and have some sort of connection and people must always feel that they can tune in and they'll be welcome there. You know, they can feel like they're part of the crew, part of the team, or like a little community, you know, that listens and that tunes in all the time. I mean, you have people emailing the same people. Some of them, you get to know them really, really well. And you can even respond back because you, you've come to know the sort of personalities they are. Yeah. So it's, it's tons of fun. But now you've been doing this for quite a while. And I remember one of my colleagues <laughs> did a story with you yes. um, where there was that the mini skirts um, so oh, the taxi. taxi driver yes, yes. and you went to Pretoria yes. in the taxi yeah. for the day. Yeah. Um, so there's a lot of issues that you you relate your show to and it, it's good because we need to engage with mm. on that sort of level as well. Mm. Um, one of the things that's coming up is the election. Yes. So I'm very thoughts. passionate about that. Very. We had a mini election drive of our own. Um, before registration, the second round of registration, because we had the first one in November last year. So the 7th and the 8th weekend in February, mm -hmm. that, that one, we had our own mini drive where we, I was at Fashion Week, so I just took the, ch the time to ask different people why, why they think it's important to vote. You know, sometimes you think that we just also, we are definitely just regular people, mm -hmm. but sometimes it takes just you voicing your opinion and edging people on to do the right thing that will get someone else to get onto the same bandwagon. So I, it's, it's very close to my heart. Okay. It's our civil duty. We have to. We have to. I agree with mm. you. Yeah. And it's not even to try and sway you and change your mind about who you're voting for, mm. but it's just to say that take this opportunity to to direct you know the, the, wherever this country will end up. You know, for a long time it wasn't in our hands. Things went uh, in the direction that they did despite whether or not you wanted to vote or not. You didn't have the choice. So now here's this opportunity and we cannot take it for granted. You know, I still get stunned when you find people who are so apathetic about voting and it's like, how can you possibly? That means exactly. you're not passionate about this country. Yeah. Well, I can actually now see that you are very passionate about it. So it's safe to assume that you have registered and you will Yes, I can show you my ID book. <laughs> <laughs> I've registered. Okay. Yes. We've dealt with the voting, but now let's go to the fun side of things because yeah. you are in the entertainment, lifestyle, music industry. Um, what are you enjoying at the moment? What's trendy for Azania? Oh no, I think the biggest trend right now is being an individual, which I'm loving right now. There isn't like a homogenous sort of look and feel and and tra or things that you could be into. People are doing galleries if they want to do galleries. People are doing plays if they want to, if they're just doing clubs if they want to do clubs. And just the way people are expressing themselves it's it's refreshing, mm. you know, that it's not part of the herd. I love the cosmopolitan vibe that we have in this country at oh, the yeah. moment. And you, you can just see the different personalities. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. So it's awesome. Something you did, you partook in in Feb, was the Marie Claire oh, yes, naked the issue. Naked issue. Mm, mm -hmm. Those photos were beautiful. Mm -hmm. I'll just tell you that right now. Oh, thank you. But it was for a good cause as well. That's why we did it. Um, you know, people always say, how do naked pictures? Uh, help in the fight against domestic abuse and for me it was about the auction because the pictures were going to be auctioned off and sold and the proceeds of that were going to go to power so Marie Claire has been doing this and every year they select a different charity to to assist through the naked issue so the naked issue is just a ve it's like just a vehicle of raising funds and hopefully yes there was a discussion there was dialogue that took place as a result about how does it actually help or but at least it was at the forefront of people's minds mm. and ultimately for me it was about the money being raised i can't take it out of my pocket and say this is my contribution to mm. power but if there are people out there who prepare to pay for those pictures and um the money goes to a good cause then 
cool. Stuff. Well, good on you. The Turtle Blitz is about, you know, just easing people into their days and, you know, having fun and having discussions. Um, beautiful music. I mean, we can hear it in the background. Yes, yes. So, what's your current favorite song? Oh, um, I've got a couple of songs that make my day, but right at the top of the list is a guy called Kruner. He's okay. got a song called Nunu, and that song just always puts me on cloud nine. Okay. I love the way he delivered it. He's got his own vibe, his own swag in the song. So I just love it, and it was a surprise for me because I thought, wow, when I heard it, you know. So that's okay. my favorite right now. Cool. But I'm still listening to Asha. This is months later, but Which, I'm still Asha or no Asha, Nigerian the Nigerian Asha. Asha. Okay. Nigerian okay. Asha. She's, yes. Oh, her album's awesome. Yes, she's autographed it for me because really? I, yeah, I was emceeing at the Standard Bank Joy of Jazz in Joburg, and she was there. Mm. So I was at the stage that she was performing at, and I mean, I had my CD. I knew she was coming. I had my CD, and I was just hoping that she's a nice enough person to sign it and you know give me a, a little note or whatever and sure enough she did oh, so awesome. i i i covered that okay i look after it like it's like it's yeah, treasure it's very precious okay. to me. i actually saw her and double hp performing at the mamas oh wow because i was there in the stadium i promise you it was just one of the most incredible performances oh, i've seen and she's I, I like, she's amazing on stage. But she's then amazing. together, the chemistry, you'd say that wow. they were like completely in love. For a while. Is it? Yeah, it was unbelievable. Sure. If you can get that. Now I'm jealous. Can... I thought I had observed and seen something special. <laughs> well, we're going to let you get back to your show. Yes, Zania. please, get out. I'm joking. <laughs> <laughs> I've never been told to get out. <laughs> Just That's joking. That's I'm done. Bye. <laughs> okay, well, it's been awesome chatting to you. Thank you for Thank joining you. me on the Bond Podcast. Thank you And we'll for catch up with us. you soon. Okay. Hi, I'm Azania Ndoro, Metro FM DJ on Total Bliss 9 to 12, Monday to Friday. Watch me on the Von Vodcast.